This piece is called Sold. It's uh, 16 by 20. Pretty self-explanatory. Um, you have about 11 Africans who've been captured and um, wielded off to, to be slaves in a foreign land called Sold. It's, um, it's kind of like an in-your-face piece. Um, put a lot of thought into it and finally brought it into fruition. This piece is, I've been told, is very thought provocative. And keep in mind, after completing these pieces, this is a 16 by 20 as well. I haven't been so enthused about selling any of my work. Honestly, I haven't. Um, but this piece is called Lost Within Freedom. And what it details and conveys is to be bound on a plantation to day in and day out to deal with the reality the misery associated with having been born into that um, and it's like he just had his urge to just flee run, run for freedom and it's almost like getting out there and not really knowing what is east, what is west what is north, what is south and even should I learn what they are where do I go? Should I go back and deal with the possible consequences that I come up missing or go back and make it and continue to deal with the conditions? I mean, at least, you know, there's a cabin that waits for me and um, there's food that awaits for me. Or should I continue to explore and perhaps attain what I've heard about to be freedom? And sometimes that's how we are as people. I mean, we set out to be free of situations, circumstances, of people, uh, toxic people. And we get out here and it's like, damn, I put up with him for all these years. He was the breadwinner. And I'm out here. I mean, I've left. I'm out here. But should I continue? Or should I go back and play this role that, okay, I'm in the wrong. I shouldn't have walked out. You know, be apologetic for wanting freedom and continue to deal with the abusive relationship, you know. Um, lost within freedom, you know, to set out to attain freedom and to be impacted by fear to the degree that you like, damn, should I go back or should I continue? And that's what being lost in freedom means to me. Lost within freedom is this piece. Although colorful. This piece is called Light Skin. I called it Light Skin because in essence, this is like a rundown cabin. You have your greenery in the background. These are little bushels. And they cake around this rundown cabin. And here is a slave owner who has abandoned one of his female African-American slaves in the back. And although you see him, approximately nine months later, will come a light-skinned child. So I call this one light skin. Yeah, light skin is the theme behind this one. This work is called Born into Cotton. Um, you have generations here already on the scene, already slaves. And here's another, you know, African American child being born into slavery. Cotton Birth is actually the name of this one Cotton Birth. And then you have your overseer standing over them, like, you know, withdraw this child so y'all can get back to what y'all supposed to be doing as well as her you know it give her a little time to heal up but it's back to business cotton business